Texarkana ISD partnered with the Bowie County Health Clinic for an on-site vaccination clinic today. NBC 6's Sydney Simone joining us now live on campus, sharing more on that. Sydney, good evening. Good evening, Dan, Jackie. Today, many teachers at TISD are taking a step toward making their school a safer place by getting vaccinated. Did it hurt? It hurt a little bit. <laughs> The pain wasn't enough to stop this teacher from completing the vaccination process. But it wasn't too bad. Though. It wasn't too bad, no. The Bowie County Health Clinic is providing hundreds of Johnson & Johnson vaccine doses to several districts in the area. The Texarkana Independent School District is one of them. We feel like there's been so much that the schools need to get the kids back in. So once the teachers were opened up, we were like, we've got to get to the schools. We've got to get the teachers vaccinated because the kids need to be there. The teachers need to be taken care of. Superintendent Doug Brubaker says he's grateful the district has the resources to present their employees with the option to get vaccinated. I sense a little bit of relief once you've been vaccinated because you know life's going to change for you in a little bit, that you're not going to be at the same level of risk that, that we, we have been. Officials say the goal is to vaccinate over 300 employees at the one day clinic. That's a little under a third of their staff. At first it was a hard decision, but um, I thought about all the people that I am in contact with and I just didn't want to take anything home. So that's kind of what made me make the decision. Special education teacher Vanetta Hughes says she wants to encourage her peers to take preventative measures. I don't want to pass anything to our kids or at school or at home. Now, according to the CDC, you're not fully vaccinated until 14 days after your last dose. In this case, it's Johnson & Johnson. So, two Wednesdays from today. Reporting live in Texarkana, Texas, Sydney Simone, NBC6 News. All right, we're making progress. Thank you, Sydney. Coming up, when you could be receiving your COVID relief check. Plus, the flooding forecast.